It's Monday. Um, it's cold. It's 61 outside. And to me, that's cold. <laughs> um, it's rainy. It's going to rain all day. Drizzly. Later on, it's supposed to get um, stronger storms. And I want to go to the movies. Do you guys like to go to the movies? Honey's home. <laughs> you guys know he never just watches TV. But he's been down in the living room and cuddled up in a blanket watching TV. Shark attacks. Okay. Anyway, I was like, let's go to the movies. He's like, oh. I was like, that's why I laughed at you the other day when you said we should go see a movie. And he's like, yeah, but I thought that meant you didn't want to. And I was like, you know I like to go to the movies. You don't like to go to the movies. That's why I laughed because I knew you were full of poop. So anyway, so I'm like, let's go to the movies. And he's like, uh, so I'm trying to convince him to go see, let's see what it's called. Because when I showed him the preview a while back, The Dark Tower, horror sci-fi fantasy. And he was like pumped to go see that. And there's lots of different, different showings. What theater is that? Okay, that's Highlands Ranch. Yeah, I mean, there's lots of times to go see it. So, I'll let you know. Anyway, I'm working on, where is it? Oh, here it is. Um, well, it's still drying. I'm working on an altered clock for the Magnolia design team, and I can't share that on my channel, guys. So, you've got to subscribe to the Magnolia channel so you can see this. And I'm doing... Um, kind of a tutorial I am um, doing a photo tutorial if that makes any sense where I take pictures of the different steps so I hope you guys will watch um, anyway I've gotten a lot of comments one of them was nasty are you ready finally someone who doesn't like my channel that actually had the balls to say so. Um, I was really impressed by that. Let's see. Let's see if I can find it. Okay. Oh, no, that's not it. Did they delete it? Oh, here it is. Um, can't even pronounce the name of her channel. I C R E Y I I C Reyes one. Anyway, it says I used to like your channel, but then you flapped your gums just one too many times. Bye, girl. So I responded, and I said I admire that you took the time to say how you feel. Thank you. I'm like, one too many times. I flap my gums one too many times. Well, I flap my gums a lot, so it must have been more than one too many. And I'm just wondering if it had to do with my political views. And if it did, hey, we can agree to disagree. That's cool. But anyway, she did have the coconut balls to, to at least comment. And I admire that because, you know, so many are just, yeah, you know, there's thumbs down and don't say anything. It's like, tell me how you really feel. Because it doesn't hurt my feelings. Um, anyway, so I realized we didn't do comments last week either. I always, on Mondays, I always watch my vlog. Well, not really watch it, but I listen to my vlog while I'm crafting. Just so I can remember all the things that I talked about. Um, but Lottie Lobby Lou, you had a very you long comment. Oh, look, there he is. <laughs> It is later. Monday evening. It is 6.16 and guess what? Honey and I are actually going to the movies. It's a miracle. How many of you guys like to go to the movies? I love going to the movies. Growing up, my dad and I would go to the movies together. We loved the movies. And I saw all, I'm sure I've told you this before, but we saw all the Planet of the Apes movies. And there's a Planet of the Apes movie out right now. But... 
it's not honey he's seen a few of them with me but I knew what movie he'd want to see and I what is it called um, one to Fandango because that's where I bought the tickets at and that will tell me I think it's called called the high something my computer is thinking it's been raining all day the dark tower okay so that's what we're gonna see and um, it's called it's horror sci-fi fantasy they have a written description gunslinger Roland Deshane roams an old west like landscape in search of a dark tower in the hopes of reaching it hope that reaching it will persevere his dying world um We will see. It's got one, two, three, three and a half stars on Rotten Tomatoes. But it had five stars on Fandango. So anyway, we'll definitely give you a review when we get out. So I just had my dinner. It was ravioli. And it was actually really good but I could eat five more of these. <laughs> Usually I eat vegetables um, with my dinner, but it's like, what vegetables do you really eat with ravioli? I guess you could have a salad, but I didn't buy any salad stuff because I've been eating mostly cooked vegetables. But I will show you what I have for my snack for at the movies because I'm allowed three cups of popcorn a day. Where's my little book? Where's my little book, my little daily tracker book? My window's like cracked open and it's cold outside. So I'm kind of looking forward to wearing a coat. So it says limited extra servings. Hold on. And this is not water. I don't drink water. This is fruit infused water. I'm going to show you that too. Okay, so limited extra servings. And it says an extra is a serving of any food that meets the following criteria 10 to 35 calories, between 10 and 35 calories. It adds flavor or texture to your food. It helps you enjoy your food more. Create your own extras using your favorite foods and enjoy up to three extras per day. So, popcorn is on the list. It says one cup and you can buy those little packets of pre-pop popcorn. Um, I think it's called Smart Something. Anyway, it's 35 calories a bag and it's one cup of popcorn and it comes in all different flavors. So I bought that and so for the movies I put in three bags of the popcorn and then I also get where is it I get one snack in the evening and that's a Nutrisystem snack so there's like frozen snacks and there's like bar snacks and cookie snacks and one of the snacks that I picked was a little uh, bag of mixed salted nuts and so I mix that in with my popcorn and like I said I will show that to you um, but yeah so that's a cool snack I get to have at the movie so I feel like you know I'm having the whole movie experience but I'm still on my plan this afternoon I had an apple with one spoon of peanut butter anyway I'm sure you're tired of hearing what I eat anyway so one of my super cool subscribers a couple of years ago sent me this bracelet. It has all kinds of Walking Dead stuff on it. And I found this gun at Hobby Lobby and I added it to this bracelet. 
And I haven't actually worn this bracelet, but I'm gonna wear it tonight. Why do I look blurry? There we go. <laughs> I think it's because I held this up. Anyway, I'm gonna wear it tonight. And when I'm done wearing it tonight, I am going to hang it on my rear view mirror. It's been hanging up right up there on one of my my knobs on, on a drawer. <laughs> yeah. I don't know if you guys have ever really seen my desk. I'm going to show you. Um, but anyway, I love this thing. It says, keep calm and kill zombies. And there's a baseball cap, and that's for Glenn. And there's a hatchet. That's for Rick. There is a samurai sword. That's for Michonne. There's TWD for The Walking Dead. There's wings and an arrow, a bow and arrow, and that is for um, Norman Reedus. Why is his name escaping me? Then the big gun that I showed you, that is for Rick. She had a gun already on, on there, this little one, and this one is for Rick. There's a motorcycle. That's for Norman Reedus. There's a hammer, and I think that is for Tyrese. And there's a cowboy hat, which is for Rick and for Carl. There's an R for me, for Rena. And then there's a, like a, a knife, which they all have knives. There's a baby bottle, that's for Judith. And there's handcuffs for Rick, so. That's all the charms on here. Anyway, let's go to the kitchen and I'll show you what I mean with about my infused water. Here we okay, are. Bye. This is my pitcher. And I have my fruit in there and I squeeze it into there and then I add the water and then I just add my, my Splenda. So, voila. <laughs> and then here is my popcorn snack that I will be eating at the movies. So, honey's getting ready. He should be coming out of there any minute. Guys, it's Tuesday. And didn't like the movie. What was it called? The High Tower? Dark Tower? Something like that? Mm. I mean, no. Uh, honey didn't like it either. I mean, we didn't hate it. Well, we really just didn't like it. So anyway, that's all I got to say about that. And I am working on another nautical project. <laughs> I couldn't think of the day. I want to call it a sea theme. Sea themed. Um, but Everybody calls them nautical. So, I am actually altering a paintbrush for a swap with Karen. I can't remember Karen's last name. Anyway, uh, we agreed to do, she had posted how um, she loves altered paintbrushes and how she'd like to swap with people. So, I jumped on it. Because I've never altered a paintbrush. And then I thought, oh, I will, um, I will alter a paintbrush and I will do it in a, a nautical theme. So, I am eating my breakfast. Here it is. It looks like an egg McMuffin, doesn't it? I mean, it looks good. It is good. I like it. But next month, because I ordered some, like, honey buns and muffins. And the muffins are, like, this pig. So, I'm going to just order bunches of these. Because I like having that for breakfast. And I got my, my infused water. And I just made a new batch. So, I am getting a lot of... A lot of you entering my challenge. Yay! I may even add some more stuff. Who knows? 
Nobody knows. Um, anyway, I'm excited about this paintbrush. And I just thought I would come and let you guys know. Really didn't like the movie. So. I got a coupon from Hobby Lobby. It's fall. They got all their fall stuff up. They got, they've had their Christmas stuff up for like two months. They've been putting it up there. So anyway, I'm looking on Pinterest, getting some inspiration for this paintbrush. And I found one. I re it's not a paintbrush. It's an altered canvas. But I really like it. And I'm hoping... I think, it, I think I need to put some lace on this project. I'm going to have to. And I've almost got the room ready for the tour. Nobody has mentioned if they're even interested in a new tour. So. I, ow. Oh, I just dug my toe with this stupid ladder. Okay. I'm going to put this out. And I'm going to close my drawer. Look. wooden stuff and I'm going to look for some lace to go on oh you know what I think I'll take out my scrap bag I'll be able to find some some scraps I'm sure ooh that looks like a good piece Mm. It's not long enough. I don't know why, but I always have to make it a little bit shabby. Just a little bit shabby. That would be good. Even though I'm gonna... I'm gonna, um... What do you call it? mixed media it <laughs> so I'm gonna well I don't know anyway I should have done a video but I mean who knows what to put on a, a nautical themed lace project but I think that's gonna work that all right I'm gonna hush because I never get anything done when I'm trying to talk and craft, it just never pans out well for me. So I'm gonna let you guys go and I will maybe talk to you in a little bit. So it's so funny. I I hadn't looked at my, um, my comments today on my vlog. And it's funny because it seems I stirred up some trolls. It's been, you know, it's probably like four or five vlogs that I've been um, saying. I don't know why I'm getting so many thumbs down. Well, apparently some of my trolls thought they should tell me why I'm getting thumbs down. And uh, you know what I have to say to that? That is awesome that you guys came out of the shadows and showed us who the people are that don't enjoy. Why do you waste your time watching? And, you know, one of them, let's see, <laughs> one of them said, I get more thumbs down on my clogs. I don't have any clogs. And if I did, I probably wouldn't show them to you because I'd be embarrassed to have a clog um, because I'm opinionated. Aren't we all opinionated? We all have opinions. We all feel like our opinions are good opinions. I do. I have opinions. Do you have opinions? I bet you do. I think you do. Um, and let's see. I'm not a very nice person. How do you know? Are you basing me being nice on the fact that I have opinions? I think I'm a really nice person. Um, I think a lot of you that watch think I'm a nice person. I just don't know how I can, how you could describe me as not a nice person um, based on the fact that I have opinions. Okay. 
Um, that's your opinion and you're allowed to have it. Take a look at my attitude. Okay, so my attitude. Again, I think that you're basing your comment on the fact that I'm a conservative and you're a liberal. And it's okay for you to be a liberal. And it's okay for me to be a conservative. It's okay. It'll be all right. Um, so you had to laugh about how it wasn't even on my radar that it could be me. Okay. Well, I just sit here and talk about my life and I talk about crafty stuff. And yes, I talk about my opinions. But it's like, do you watch, I don't know, do you watch a show week in and week out and you hate that show? You really don't like that show. But do you keep watching it? Seems like there could be something wrong with you if that's how you like to spend your time is watching stuff that you don't like. Just saying. Um, as far as my pond goes, it's your opinion too that it's hideous. I think it's really pretty. I think it could be, could have been better. But you know what? I've never built a pond. I interviewed these people. They sounded very knowledgeable. Um, I saw some of their previous work. It looked very beautiful. I made a mistake. I chose the wrong person to do the job. I learned a very expensive and valuable lesson. And I tell you what, it ain't gonna get repeated. So, anyway, it seems like uh, Debbie Graffi has kind of put you in your place. Debbie, that was a good one. <laughs> I enjoyed it. Um, but anyway, bottom line here, people. Um, we're all entitled to our opinions. And yeah, I don't like, I, I don't know what his name is. I think it's PewDiePie. He's like supposedly the most subscribed YouTube person ever or something like really 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 popular but I don't get him so I don't watch him um, there's a lot of channels I don't get their type of humor or their type of conversation I just don't get it or I don't like it or I'm not into it but I don't sit there and watch it every week and then tell them what douchebags they are but anyway if that makes you feel better that's totally cool Stay tuned, and I'll see hey guys, you next I thought time. I'd show you real quick. I uh, have been working on this project this morning, as I told you, and I used some of my sprays and stuff, and I didn't really like how it came out. So I am outside, and this is—it's hard to cover this um, some of these sprays up with white gesso. So I decided I would come out here, and I don't know if I'm making a mistake or not, we'll see, but I'm going to spray paint it. And I'm going to do that, and then I'll gesso it when I get home later. And it'll be easier to start over with it. I even have some of this, let me try this. What do you guys think? Kind of like it with a little bit of that teal. It actually looks like it's going to match the papers pretty good too. Okay. Well, there it is. Look what Honey did. 
He made little, he put little bricks out to my painting bench. Oh, I should put the lid back on. I keep I I do keep the paint outside during the summer. But anyway, I thought it was really nice. He put these little made me a little stand. There's my doggie. And there's my hideous pond over there. So I've been told. You know, they could have done it better. But I still love it. Honey just really doesn't love it because he's got to fix it. Anyway, he put some new plants in the ground in the front. And, um... I'll show you those later in the week. Talk to you guys later. Hi guys. It's Thursday. I am having a guilty... Well, I'm allowed to have one. Actually, I really probably could have two. Because I only use about a shot of milk. And I guess two shots of milk would be half a cup of milk. Yeah. Well, okay. So this is just my second cup of tea. Anyway, I drink vanilla chai. I love it. I usually don't have two, but I gotta tell you, it's really feeling like fall around here. Uh, it's been like in the 40s in the morning, and you know, sometimes it barely gets to 60 during the day. It's been raining a lot. Um, we'll have periods of real bright sunshine during the day, but every day for like, it feels like two weeks or so, it's been raining every day. Um, we get some nice thunder showers. I really love thunder showers. Anyway, I always like to re-watch, um, my videos after I share them. I like to rewatch them so I can, you know, learn if like if I made some boo-boos or mistakes and, um, you know, figure out how to do them better in the, in the future. And, um, one of the things that I've really been noticing is that when I'm doing a project share, I say, um, a lot. Um, this, um, that, and I got to work on that because that's probably got to be annoying when you're watching, but, um, I just did it, but, um, <laughs> anyway, I am working on a card to send Karen to more, to more. I think I, I'm not sure how to say it. But um, I'm working on a card to send with her altered paintbrush. And I sent her a link to the video. She said she loved it. She said she loves nautical stuff. And she has done some nautical projects. So I am hoping that she really does love it. <laughs> so anyway... Um, um, see, I just did it. Oh. Have any of you guys noticed that you do that or how to break yourself of it? Now I feel, uh, I said, uh, <laughs> self-conscious. I don't know. Anyway, um, I love working with this collection, um, this nautical, kind of vintage nautical collection. I really do. And you guys know I'm not a vintage -y. I don't create a lot of vintage stuff. But I am enjoying it. I created a card for my mom. I'm going to do a project share video before I go today. We have, we only have like 11 today, but every one of them is huge. So that's like doing 20. <laughs> so I'll have to probably get out of here. A little bit earlier than normal. I went to 
Michaels and Hobby Lobby yesterday, and that felt awesome. Um, so, hey guys, it's Friday afternoon, and Rihanna's going to be coming. I'm going to go pick her up soon, and I got this pot and several others so that she can have a mermaid fairy garden. So I wanted to show you a picture of it first. There's several others I got to spray paint, and then I'll show you the finished, um, well, it won't be finished finished, but it'll be painted, the fairy garden. <laughs> She's very shy. Oh, I forgot to trim this ear. All right, let me do that. Say bye, Sky. Bye. And I did, I cut my hand. Okay, guys, Ryan. Hey, did you just pull a leaf off? Don't no. pull anything off. No, Ryan, I just and I just, Ryan and I just picked up these pants. Look at these beautiful cactuses. And they're not even painted. That's the color they actually are. Mm -hmm. And we got those. Now, cool. We're gonna spray paint our pots. Look what look what color I got, Rye. Whoa! Glitter. And some potting mix. I love glitter. You're a glitter girl. Yeah. My little kitty has to be on the ground for. A little bit because she needs to go potty. Oh, okay. Mm -hmm. Okay, Rihanna and I are going through all the ocean stuff. Mm -hmm. The seashells and everything. I'm the carrying of the seashells. And then we're going to do some hot gluing onto these pots. Mm -hmm. And then we're going to spray paint them again. Mm -hmm. These are wonderful. And yeah, but, but we can't leave them orange because that's not our... Oh, look, I brought the box of sea urchins. Let's show everybody the sea urchins. Oh. Let's set these down. These are jellyfishes? Those are sea urchins. These are sea urchins? Very good. And they took the body out. And yeah. And uh, when, well, they were actually really jellyfishes, but. <laughs> uh oh. I think we have your seashell top on inside out. Oh, well. I guess it doesn't matter. It's just us, right? Mm -hmm. All right. I got to go in the house and get some more stuff. I'll be back, Say okay? Hi, fans. Hi, fans. Hi, fans. <laughs> We are working to get this fairy garden all decorated. Right? And mommy's a mermaid garden. Mermaid garden. That is correct. Thank you for correcting me. That's that's what it is. Mm -hmm. This is for mermaids. Mm -hmm. Like me. And who who are we gonna have to invite back over? Ariel. Ariel. Yeah. I think Ariel is going to need to come back and see the mermaid house mm -hmm. before we go to Disney World. Mm -hmm. And then when you see her at Disney World, you can be like, do you remember coming to my house? Mm -hmm. managed to burn myself with the hot glue gun. <laughs> Look, right here, can you see it? Yeah. Oh, you guys can't see it. <laughs> yeah. Alright, we'll be back to show you our progress. Yeah, come back before you know it. Okay. But, huh? um, um, you will see it all pretty when we are done, and Grandma will turn on the video when we are done.
Bye, fans. Okay, guys, this is what the pots are looking like. Rihanna has now decided she doesn't want the seashells painted. So, <laughs> the next batch will be natural, a la natural. The fair mermaid has finished her mermaid garden. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And this is how it looks. Mm -hmm. It looks beautiful, right? Mm -hmm. Here, I got you a few more shells if you want to put them around the other plants. And this could be right there. Yeah, we're, I'll get another pot and we'll make a fairy garden for down there, okay? Mm -hmm. She's going to be like this. Hey guys, <laughs> check this out. We have a lone frog. Where'd you go? There you are. He's part green and part brown. Oh, I lost him again. There he is. What's going on? It's Sunday afternoon. The mermaid is in the pool. But the clouds are rolling in. Oh, she has legs. She's a human right now. Watch <laughs> She's got a new water toy over there. What are you going to name your new water toy? Slow duty. Slow duty? Yeah. Uh, what? This one's name is Sister. No, that one is my sister is named Lizzie Cuff. You just told her, come on, Sister. Kind of windy. But she wanted to be in the pool. We got some clear skies over there, so maybe maybe that'll roll on through. <laughs> she was able to get on top of that thing, and normally she jumps on and she falls off. And look at her, she's on there. <laughs> She can't control which way she's going, but she's on there. <laughs> now you can say hi, fans. Hi, fans. <laughs> uh, All right, now Sandy, Sandy water play time. <laughs> All right, you want me to scoot your chair closer so you don't have to tip it over like that? Mm -hmm. All right. Okay, here's how this ended up. Oh, let me. All right. So the fairies live down at the bottom. And then up here. You already showed them. I know. I'm going to show them again. I just love it. Aren't these plants absolutely spectacular? They actually look like they belong with mermaids. Sunday afternoon. Rihanna's in the bath right next door and I just realized I haven't done comments. Have I done comments? I don't think I've done comments. And it's crazy to me. Last week I got 14 thumbs down. Go me, right? 
<sighs> wow. It's amazing to know so many people have nothing better to do. But a lot of you have commented <laughs> and, okay, so Oasis Pet Spa Frank Town. That is my friend, my real life friend who I talked to groom many, 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 many moons ago. Um, that's Megan and she says, hi Rena, I wasn't sure how to comment while watching on my phone. She puts it on her phone and listens to it while she's driving. <laughs> she's a lunatic. Um, I'm most excited to see the vlog. Of course you are, because you're not a crafty person, Megan. You're a dog grooming person. All right. Is it Glennis? G-L-Y-N-I-S Cook? She says, Hi, Rena. I don't normally content comment. One of the lurkers, LOL. I have tried to choose just one thing I like, but most... I like most, but I watch because I like all of your projects and the vlog. But if I was really pushed, it would be the cards. Congratulations on the weight loss. And yes, it is notable. Honey hadn't noticed. And in my work clothes, he kept saying, I can't tell. I can't tell. And today I put, you know, regular clothes on. And he's like, okay, now I can tell. <laughs> so, um, yay. 12 pounds as of, so it's three weeks and I've lost 12 pounds. And they tell you they guarantee 13 pounds in a month. So I'm very, very happy. Um, Leanne, who's signed on under David Donaldson, says, Hi, Rena. I'm one that lurks and hardly ever comments on your vlog. But I do on your card videos, which I love. Congrats on your weight loss. Keep up the excellent work, Leanne. Thank you. Makes me feel good that it's noticeable. Uh, Mildred, hi, I think many people are on holiday. I love the vlogs and projects are on the same channel. I hope it stays that way. It is, how many are? <sighs> it is amazing that you lost so many pounds already, especially with the party. You go, girl. Really proud of you. Uh, love to see the little house again. So beautiful. The photos were beautiful. I think she means of the wedding. Patricia Perkins, hey there, Rena. Um, I could just... It could just be that it's summer and people are busy outside more and gone more. But for me, it's the cards are my number one favorite. Mini albums, number two, and mixed media, not so much for me. Just a quick note, the plants up front just need to be deadheaded. Cut out the stalks down at the base of the plant. It won't hurt them and you'll be happier. And I'm going to take your advice. Absolutely. Dana Imos. Hi, Rena. I remember when I subscribed. It was your cards that I love still after two years, if not longer, as time flies. I love your amazing cards and projects, and I look every day to see what's new. Smarty Pants Kids. Beautiful wedding pictures. Thanks for keeping me going while I was working out at the YMCA. Makes my time on the bike go so much faster. That's a really good idea. Um, Karen Z. Hi, Rena. I always look forward to watching your vlog, and I really enjoyed seeing all of your beautiful wedding photos. All of the beautiful wedding photos, because it was not mine. Uh, mini albums and mixed media are my favorite crafts. I'm a real sucker for tutorials. I can sit for hours watching tutorials, and it's always fun learning something new. Congrats on your weight loss this week. Dieting is so, so hard. Actually, this program makes it super easy. I really recommend it. Um, but back to the tutorials thing, I like tutorials too, but I like talking tutorials. I don't like music tutorials at all. They're actually very annoying to me because I want to, sometimes I want to be doing something and I don't want to have to be watching. I could be listening, but if it's just music, you have to watch. Sandra Sundell, gotta say, I'm at the time in my life when I have little filter Okay, this is gonna be good. What the hell is with wrong with people that have so much negative attitude and feel the need to spread their negativity? It's rather obvious they're watching. Okay, have to calm down for a minute. If they're watching it, turn it off if you're not happy with it. But why waste the time to write such rude negative posts? Just go away and let the rest of us enjoy. Grr. And by the way, we now know a couple of the thumbs downers. I was going to say more, but I guess my filter is working better today. Love you, friend I've never met. 
Okay, one more thing. Good luck with the weight loss. You're doing great. I could really see the loss in your face. Thank you, Sandra. Debbie Graffius, I watch every week and most of your sharing videos. I'm not a card maker, but I have nothing against them. My favorite is altered items, and I would really love on any channel a process video. Good luck with the Nutrisystem. I couldn't do it. I'm too picky of an eater. I am watching portion sizes and carbs and I've lost 30 pounds in about six months. That's excellent, especially without you know a specific weight loss plan. Uh, now I'm getting the flab and bat wings. Okay, I'm not gonna show you mine, but that's the first thing I thought when he said that. I was in the restroom today and they had the high power blower rather than the paper towels and boy, did I see that loose skin blow. Just made me giggle. If anyone, I would have would have come in, they would have probably thought I was a loon. <laughs> Too funny. Okay. Linda Warrington. I don't remember that name. Um, oh, that's because she left me a nasty comment. Um, you get more thumbs down on your clogs. I think I already read this one. Um, yeah, okay, I read this one. Yeah, Debbie, you responded to her. <laughs> Jessica Darby. I enjoy all the videos you do. Keep up the good work. Thank you. And I've never seen a comment from you, I don't think, so I appreciate that. Solvi Helen Silnes. Hi, Rena. I often are thinking about commenting, but then I start to overthink my English. Love your vlogs the most. The wedding picture of Rihanna in the room with the wedding dress were so beautiful. I know the photographer was just spectacular. Um, Debbie, you say, hey, Rena, I love when you go in the little house and shut the door. It's like you can't hear anything. It's just silent, just like it's a little place away from the world. And I have to tell you something. So today, um, I told Rihanna she was in the pool and playing in the sand and making the fairy garden and everything. And, um, I said, okay, we're going to, it's going to be time to go get in the bathtub because we have to go, you know go back to daddy's in a couple hours and she's like oh I have to go back today and I was like yeah today you know today's the day you have to go home she was like oh, I just love it here grandma it's my dream come true oh, I heard angels singing that's what I want this to be I want this to be you know, when she's at home, she's in normal mode, normal life, you know, things that families do, you know, little girls, they go to school, they hear the baby crying, and, you know, it's time to pick up your room, and, I mean, not that she doesn't have to pick up here, because I make her pick up, but, I mean, it's, it's like a little getaway, it's like a little fantasy every time she gets to come, and she loves her little house as a mermaid, she, I think she loves it way better than she did when it was pink and um we had a lot of fun today so it melted my heart when she was like being here is my dream come true ah, okay um I just wanted to let you know I love your water fountains and I think they're beautiful I'll be glad when you get them the way you want them so you can put your koi fish in there and also the saturated canary mermaids where Oh, she wanted to know where she can find those. Okay, for anybody that wants the saturated canary mermaids, they're retired. Um, they're retired. I did have somebody message me, though, and say that she contacted Krista Smith directly and that she sold her some. So maybe go to her Etsy store. Um, look under saturated canary or Krista Smith. So, yeah. Jeanette Solomon. Rena, everything you make is amazing and I love your vlog just the way it is. I look forward to it every week and I'm always interested in everything you talk about. Personally, I love listening to you flap your gums, lol. <laughs> don't change a single thing about you. I just don't get why some people need to be rude and hurtful. You are wonderful and tons of us love you just the way you are. Mini albums and the vlog are my favorite because I don't make cards, but your cards are always adorable and I watch every single thing you post. Thank you. I've got a really cool ocean mixed media project coming up, girl, and you're going to want to see it. I've been getting a lot of inspiration on Pinterest um, for mixed media, and oh my gosh, I've got some great ideas for Halloween mixed media. I'm so excited. I bought some canvases the other day when they were on sale, and I'm just like itching to get going, but I'm going to show you what I'm working on, and you guys won't, this is, 
Are you ready? That's what I'm working on. And I'm going to show you another one just because I feel like teasing you. Ta-da! All right. I've got a total of five here, but that's all you get to see. Um, Rosa Kelly scrapbooking. Blah, blah, blah. Rosa Kelly scrapbooking. I love your talent. Your shadow boxes are incredible, and your cards are very inspirational. But I most definitely get most excited over your shabby mini albums. You know, I really need to do a shaped mini album. And the other day, I kind of felt like it. So I went and looked at my stash, and I don't have any shaped mini albums to work on. So that was disappointing, because... When I get in the mood, I need to just do it. Anyway. Um, Deborah Hazeldine. I've never heard that last name before. Um, it says, mini albums with an exclamation point. Jackie Turner. Some people just need to go away quietly into the night and they won't be missed. <laughs> Thanks for all you do. <laughs> too funny. Thank you, Jackie. Um... Teresa Lynn Nelson Moss. That is a very long name. She says, I watch everything you post and I love everything, but my most favorite would be your cards and your blogs. Thank you. Andrea Stever. Rena, I love everything you make. You, your cards are simply gorgeous. I love watching your vlogs. I wouldn't change that. I would love to see more tutorials though. You are my inspiration when it comes to shabby chic. Aw, thank you. And I love you for that. I have started doing some mixed media tags because of you, and I thank you for that too. XOXO, your YouTube friend always. Thank you. I don't know if I've ever seen you comment before. That was a very nice comment. Thank you. Paula Hatton Vines, love all your cards, mini albums, and altered items. Don't change a thing. Sometimes we get busy and don't comment, but we're still watching. Always look forward to the vlog. Paula's one of my biggest fans. She buys from me. Thank you, Paula. Jennifer Richards. Rena, I love everything you make and do. You can't make everyone happy. And there's always going to be haters. Do what makes you happy. Keep crafting beautiful items. You're a true inspiration. Love seeing all the wedding photos. I also can't wait to hear about your giveaway. Oh, hopefully you guys have seen the giveaway. It's really easy. It'll take you about five minutes to do the stuff you got to do. It doesn't cost you anything. You gotta, don't got to make anything. Check out my video uh, for my giveaway. Even you haters, you're welcome to join in too. Ellen Eileen. I'm not going to say your last name because it is a doozy. I enjoy all of your crafts, but I especially learn a lot from your mini albums, your mini albums and vlogs. Sherry Vaughn, I enjoy mini albums and altered items. I love your vlog and look forward to watching every Monday morning while I have, I have my coffee. <laughs> you guys know I don't drink coffee. I drink tea. Lori Marcucci, hi, Rena. Personally, I like your vlog the way it is. Variety is the spice of life. I watch all your videos, especially like the mixed media videos. Oh, somebody that likes mixed media, um, but love them all. I think life just gets crazy and maybe YouTube videos have to take a back seat for a while, but I always watch when Monday comes along. That's cool. Thank you. Mindy, Mendy's Crafty Creation. Hi, Rena. I love everything you make. I really look forward to all your projects and your vlogs. Always make me laugh or smile at some point, so I enjoy those as well. Keep up the great work and congratulations on your weight loss. Thanks for sharing. P.S. The wedding photos were gorgeous. Hope to see more. I hope there are more. There should be more. Lots more. Angela Perkins, I look forward every week to your vlog. I rarely comment, so I guess I'm a lurker. I'm just not a big talker, sort of shy. I so enjoyed the card tutorial and look forward to the others on your list. The cowboy is here. Say hi, cowboy. <laughs> look how white his beard is. It's very white. Remember the pictures in the wedding? He wasn't white. But I think it's, I think it's sexy. Hey, I would like to thank you guys all for your birthday wishes. <laughs> that was awesome. Thank yeah, you. You saw that? Oh, I, show them your tattoo. They haven't. I, I've never seen your tattoo. It's in Bring, case. I, it says Myers. Just in case I forget. <laughs> and and Marina here, or as or AKA Rena, has been asked if she was interested in serving her country. <laughs> I served my country. I voted for Donald Trump. <laughs> 
That's funny. What is that? That's probably for Blake. No. It's... Oh, no, it's for me. <laughs> That's funny. Okay. Can we check on her? She's fine. What did she just say? Yes, <laughs> she just said something. Um, Charlene Chapman. Chapman. I'm a lurker, LOL. Shout out. <laughs> Congrats on your weight loss, girl. I think you've commented before, but thank you. Judy Garner. Judy Garner. Judy, where have you been? I just, the other day, was up in my stash of stuff up, up there, and I saw the album that you sent me, and I was like, I'm going to pull that out in the next couple weeks, and I'm going to finish that album. So I'm going to do that. Um, she was inquiring about the candy I brought her, um, if she could have the rest of it for lunch. <laughs> she already had lunch, so yes, <laughs> give it to her. Right, she's in the tub. I said not in the tub. Oh, why not? You're no fun. Because. She's at her grandparents' house. Candy in the bathtub? Well, yeah. You can't bathe in candy. Give her the candy. Yes, ma'am. <laughs> All right. Um, okay, so Judy, yes, I'm going to finish that album coming up sometime in the next probably two to four weeks. Um, I love your mini albums and anything you do that's Halloween. Great job on your weight loss success. I know it's hard. I'm serious, guys. It's easy with this new program. Um, oh, Christine Lazarides. Congrats on your weight loss. I know it can be hard and an ongoing struggle, struggle for many, me included. Your yard looks wonderful. You've put a lot of hard work into it. Well, that guy that just was in here, he put a lot of hard work into it. I just, I'm the designer. I designed it and then he, you know, he put it together. Um, I always watch, but don't always comment. Sorry. Looking, looking forward to your next vlog. Create 557. Hi, Rena. Lurker here. LOL. <laughs> I love all your vids and you always get a thumbs up from me. Congrats on your weight loss. I know the struggle is real. Love, Diane. Diana, thank you. Um, Lottie Lobby Lou. Hi, Rena. Sorry I haven't commented recently, but I have been watching. I always seem to be in a rush after I watch. I mean to come back and comment, but then forget. And before you know it, another vlog's up. Another vlog pops up. The garden is really looking nice. The plants in the front garden are really coming in. The round one is a chrysanthemum, and it I knew what it was. It was like on the tip of my tongue, but I knew what it was anyway, but thank you. And as for the grasses, just cut down the spikes that have gone over. If you save the seeds, you might be able to grow some more. Oh, that's a good idea. Thank you for the heads up on the dandelion leaves. Who would have thought? I know. Ha ha. Hope I don't wet the bed. <laughs> when I was little, I was always told that picking the dandelion flowers made you wet the bed. The things we believe when we're little. No kidding. Um, that reminds me. I, I better stop because my vlog is going to go over an hour. And I don't know why I can't do it for over an hour. So anyway, I will see you guys next week. Have a great uh, have a great week. I hope you enjoyed the vlog this week. And if you didn't, be sure to give me a thumbs down. Bye.